Mississippi State looks to get back on track after a tough two-game skid. It's nearly been a month since the Bulldogs were back in Starkville, so home sweet home for Mississippi State. To Davis Wade Stadium, the flyover before the game as the Bulldogs added their seventh member to the MSU football ring of honor. NFL legend and former Bulldog, the late Joe Fortunato, joins the distinguished group. It's Mississippi State hosting BYU in the early matchup. First quarter we go. Bulldogs get going early. Aries Williams, the A train, flying the hurdle, gets a big run there. Leads to Nick Fitzgerald, follows his blocks, breaks some tackles. He's going to rumble on in for six. So Mississippi State leads 7 0 after one. To the second quarter we go. Fitzy showing off the arm. He's going to hook up with Donald Gray for the touchdown. So Bulldogs, they lead 14 0. But before the end of the first half, Mississippi State leading 14 to 3. More Fitzgerald looking to tack on some more, powering through defenders in this one. He's going to take the lick, finish for six. So Bulldogs lead 21 to 3 at halftime. So, third quarter we go. Mississippi State showing off the vertical passing game. Fitzgerald is going to connect with Jamal Couch for the touchdown. 32 yards. It's 28 to 3, Mississippi State. But it would get interesting late in the third. Fitzgerald, he's going to be. Drop back to pass, some pressure. He's going to sling one. It's going to be picked off by BYU, one of his two interceptions. So here come the Cougars in action. Tanner Mangum, he's going to find Oliva Hypho on a 27 yard touchdown. It'd be 28 to 10 Mississippi State after three. In the fourth, after a fumble on the kickoff, BYU's way, Mangum on fourth down. He's been picked off a huge play by Bryant, Brandon Bryant to retake the momentum for Mississippi State. And the game, here comes the A-train. Ares Williams, another strong performance, 100 yards and a touchdown in this one. Caps it off with that touchdown there, 114 yards and a score. Mississippi State rolls and celebrates a 38-10 to 10 win over BYU. Afterwards, the talk was about how good Mississippi State closed out the win in the fourth quarter after BYU made it interesting. We're driving down. Trying to put the game away in the third quarter. We, we throw a pick in the red zone. They run it back. We get a penalty. Next play, we get a penalty. Next play, they score. We fumble the kickoff. They got the ball back. I mean, that's that rope's just slipping right out of your hands. You know what I mean? You're just getting it pulled right out of your hands at that point. Uh, one of the things we do in our offseason, you know, one of the big things, every, every guy will tell you, you ask, ask him out the road, say, don't let go of that rope. They might, not, they might add another adjective in there, too. Uh, between the and the rope. And all of a sudden that rope was slipping, slipping, but you just can't let go of the rope. And they clasped. They grasped it and they pulled it right back uh, in, in all three phases. Pulled it right back. Um, and and that's, that, that's, that's pretty big for the, you know, for the team. You know, uh, that's facing that type of adversity right there where you know, hey, we, this rope's slipping. We got to put our feet in the ground and go stop it. And we got to do it ourselves. And, uh, and they went and did it. Whenever something bad goes down, I mean, we got to be ready in, in all cylinders. You know, we stop the run, we defend the pass, you know, and, and that just does a lot for us. And then that gives the offense energy when they play off of us. A win just feels good. Uh, that, that, was our, that was our main focus. But, uh, you know, I feel good to get a win. And, uh, I know some cool guys. So I think there's a lot to learn from this game. Uh, a lot of good, a lot of bad, a lot of teachable things. Uh, so, uh, big time win. We got here healthy. Everybody's uh, everybody's relatively not banged up. So uh, we're excited and we're ready for uh, SEC play next week.